hey guys um, welcome back to another video and uh, I know uh, I've been away for for a little bit uh, I got my wisdom teeth out maybe a week ago so I, I actually really wanted to make videos but my face was just so swollen and I was in pain so I didn't really want to make that uh, or make videos while I was in that state but uh my face like as you can see it's like normal it looks normal and uh like the pain is pretty much gone so i'm just gonna go back to making some more videos and uh i kind of want to get back into the swing of things with an easy video a day in the life uh or like a productive uh day in the life i guess um because i think um, I, I have a bunch of stuff today that I need to do, uh, and I guess, like, I'll explain that in the B-roll, like, what I'm specifically doing. Uh, I, I, I've been binging these videos since I, excuse me, since I was, uh, just resting in my bed from the, from the wisdom teeth surgery, so I think I might as well. I make videos that I want to watch, so stay tuned. Oh, the first thing I'm going to do today has to do stuff with my wisdom teeth and like my mouth care. So, and I'm not really going to record that because I don't really want that stuff on the internet. But I'll record, I'll start recording after my shower, and right now it is. I don't know if you guys can see it. It's. 7.18. It's pretty early in the morning. I don't know why I woke up. My body just woke up, uh, like, normally at this time. So, gotta love the internal clock. Alright, uh, so... Today, in my opinion, right, first of all, I sound, I don't sound like death right now. Second of all, I think today uh, it's pretty packed. I mean, for me and over the summer. So what I'm gonna I'm gonna study in uh, two two-hour blocks. That uh, that's what I've been trying to aim for. I'm trying to build the two, two to two uh, four-hour blocks. Uh, so for the first block, I'm gonna do some Python learning because at uh, UC Irvine, I plan to be a computer science major. Uh, and the only language I really know is uh, Swift, and that's what you use to build iOS apps. Uh, and then, so my goal, I guess, for like for the summer is to finish and learn Python. And then after that, do some like leak code questions. This like for interviews, and then apply to internships, get an internship, maybe like November, December time. So hopefully I can do that with a Python or Swift, or uh, maybe I'll. I kind of want to learn HTML, CSS, and JavaScript because they all blend well together. I think uh, Python with HTML, CSS, and JavaScript is actually going to be pretty useful. Uh, so I'm probably going to learn those when I'm at Irvine and then for the second block uh, I'm going to go through this biology textbook because uh, I mean I'll get more into it into the in the video but I'm uh, gonna be a comp sci major and I'm gonna do the pre-med prerequisites because I want to be a doctor as well so uh, and I haven't taken bio since uh, freshman year of high school uh, so I just need a refresh my memory and learn some new stuff and like th there's actually some interesting chapters here in the end like uh let me get to the index like there's neurobiology and behavior that's uh kind of like what i might want to get into there's biotechnology and bioinformatics which is in line with computer science and then human physiology uh, but of course I have to get through all the basic chapters first and which is kind of a pain and I will be taking my notes on my iPad Pro and if you guys want a video on how I take notes on my iPad Pro make sure to leave that down in the comments 
And without further ado, let's get ready to work. So in this clip, uh, you are seeing me use a software called Anki. And this is a software where I use to uh, make flashcards for both uh, Python and biology. So the first deck that I'm reviewing is called uh, Simple Data Types. I believe, yeah, variables and simple data types where you like learn how variables work, how string, like simple data types like strings, integers, floats, uh, things like that. The second deck is introduction to lists, like how to append things, how to insert things, how to remove, delete, organize, stuff like that. And then my third and final deck is biology based. It is uh, called cell theory, specialization and replacement. So it's like basic cell anatomy, uh, it's applications, uh, cell theory and things like that. Uh, I like to go through my Anki flashcards first thing in the morning uh, when I study because it's like a activity that requires uh, like not that much brain activity or like brain stress. So it kind of helps me get into uh, the studying mood. So now in this clip, uh, you can see me taking notes from the uh, Python crash course textbooks that I have that uh, I'm using to learn Python. And basically what I'm learning uh, in this part is using for loops uh, on lists uh, and how it can speed up the process of uh, performing the same function on multiple pieces of data within a list. Alright, so I've done about let's say 30 minutes of work. This is where I usually like to take a break uh, in my two hour blocks uh, just so like I don't keep on going and like make myself tired. So uh, I finished uh, this bottle of water. So I'm going to go refill it with the meal replacement that it came with. So I'm going to take you guys downstairs with me. And maybe I'll just go on social media, check my phone. You know, just give myself a nice prop. Okay, so I have no idea what I was trying to do with that, uh, like, little bit. But, so, I kind of got this. It's called Control. It's for, like, it's like a meal replacement and it has a ton of protein. Uh, so, uh, what am I trying to say? So, over, like, the week and a half, Oh, don't mind my cats. That's probably what the noise is. Um, so like the week and a half after my uh, wisdom teeth surgery, I've lost almost just 15 pounds of like fat and muscle because I've been like eating, just basically pudding and yogurt and like soup for like that week and a half. So I haven't really had like any protein or like any solid food for almost a week now. Bro, why isn't this focusing? Like, is that better? I don't know. No, this isn't the camera I usually use anyways. I'm sorry if it's out of focus. So, yeah. So I'm gonna go make myself a shaker cup of this right here. The flavor that I have is, uh, it's called Cinnamon Toast Crunch. It's what a lot of people who have reviewed this recommended as like a first flavor. Okay. So I'll just put the powder in. Uh, one serving is two scoops. So, close it. Okay, so to me, 
Uh, this flavor tastes like a cinnamon vanilla cake and it actually makes downing it pretty easy because it tastes pretty good. That should be good. I'll add a bit more. <sighs> My catch is glaring at me over there. Anyways. That is not secure. I think I'm definitely gonna either bring this bag if I still have some in it and probably buy more once I get to Irvine. So, yeah, I think I'm going to talk about, like, why I'm choosing computer science and pre-med. Hold up, let me actually go to somewhere with decent lighting. Uh, so, originally, I was... Okay, there's better lighting here. Okay. So, originally, I was trying to uh, do just straight up only computer science. Uh, that's what I applied to college for. That's what I wanted to do originally, like work at a big tech company, obviously, bounce from company to company. Um, but then, I think like two months ago, I just started watching a bunch of like medical YouTubers and like uh, with my own personal story with my knee surgery, which I think I'll probably delve into another video, like why I want to do medicine. Um, I guess a combination of seeing what they actually study and what I've experienced as well um, kind of inspires me to become a doctor and I also have two cousins that are uh, one's a podiatrist and one's trying to, pr uh, he's in residency at UC Davis I think, UC Davis for uh, orthopedic surgery so both of them also influence me as well and I still Obviously, I still want to work at a at a big tech company because I think that's pretty cool. That's pretty nice. You know, having that much impact on so many people's lives is interesting to me. So, and I didn't really want to do like a bio major because, like, say, if I don't want to, what if I don't want to go to med school after like the four years of undergraduate? Then I still have something to fall back onto, and that's kind of why I'm doing both, I guess. So anyways, let's just taste this. Ah, oh, it smells pretty good. Mm, so good. Anyways, I'm gonna go back up. Um, and then just go get right back to work. So, I think I'm gonna voice over, or I should voice over, the time lapse of me studying. And my battery's about to die, so I need to hurry up and charge this bad chicken. All right, so we're in the car. I got coffee that I, I think this is like a, a new flavor I haven't tried. Like usually I would get Starbucks around Christmas time because usually I'd spend it in uh, New York City because that's where um, my older brother lives. Um, or I mean, that, that's where I spent my uh, Christmas this year um, and I didn't release or sorry, last year 2017 2019 <laughs> um, and I just really started drinking coffee last year oh, I'm not on my seatbelt. so and I think I drank something that was like in Christmas season so I didn't really try the regular coffee but if you're wondering this is just a iced coffee with half and half and uh, vanilla let's see how it is Pretty good. Tastes pretty good. All right, so I just got home from the doctor. I need to jump on a call like right now. I'm gonna go move you guys over here, so you guys don't just don't get the same angle for the whole video. But then the lighting's crushed. But I don't care. Anyways, enjoy the call right now. All 
right, so after that uh, that quick call, I uh, took a shower because I was out and I don't want to take a chance with coronavirus out. Uh, so that call is pretty good. So we were just implementing a, a new team member into our CAS project, which is a project that you need to do for an IB diploma. And basically our project was developing an app to help streamline student and teacher communication. And so that, that person that we were trying to implement, he didn't have a project, he reached out to me and said, yeah, we can just implement you or just meet with you. Uh, try to see what you want to do with it. That'd be like marketing and UI development or the actual coding of the app. Uh, so I think the meeting actually went pretty well. He seemed pretty excited. And uh, uh, we plan to have a big overall meeting uh, later on this week. Uh, on the weekend, so that'll be nice. So right now I'm probably gonna go take a break with my brother uh, Maybe play a couple rounds of FIFA and then get to uh, some biology study All right, so I think that's gonna be it for the video to uh, video today guys So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's kind of like similar to what I've been trying to put out uh, as like a vlog style study video, but This is genuinely what I've been doing for like the past week. I've like felt useless uh, like while I was recovering from my wisdom teeth surgery and I kind of wanted to start getting productive again. You know, I don't want to lose my mental sharpness before college. Uh, so thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you like this type of content, make sure to comment down below if you want to see more of it. Uh, a travel vlog is definitely on the way because I need to go to California for college and that'll be interesting during coronavirus. So I'll make sure to vlog that. Uh, be on the lookout for that. Um, so if you wanna, if you want, if you're interested in uh, seeing what travel is like during coronavirus, make sure to stay subscribed, make sure to like the video and comment down below what type of videos you guys want to see. So until next time, see you guys later.